How much you got in your cables? Oh, I'm now. I can't, I've got to try to work a fag. Do you know what I like them? Right, you will learn this as you go through life, right? Hello everyone, welcome back to the video and today we're at the car boot to find items to sell on eBay. But today I find some items that have some decent profit to them. Some electronics, uh, some toys. So yeah, make sure you stick around to see what they are. They have some decent profit to them. But quickly, if you are new to this channel, I'd really appreciate you hit that subscribe button. I upload loads of these car boot videos here on the channel. I also upload picking orders videos as well. Also charity shop videos. So if that all sounds fun, hit that subscribe button. Because apparently by YouTube, not many of you are subscribed. So if you are new, I'd really appreciate that. And if you do enjoy this video, please leave a like. It really helps me out here. But that's enough talking from me. I'm going to let you enjoy this video. Oh, yeah. Excuse me, how much on that one? Um, it's the packet of them. Order them or? Yeah, can do. Uh, ten quid for Shoes for a bit. Oh, maybe not. Oh, yeah, they are. <laughs> Those ones. Uh, £2 each. Excuse me, uh, here's your four pound. Ah. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. What's that? £2 each in that big bag. Okay. okay. I live in Tommy Joyce. He lives in Yeah? Thank you. Sorry. How much on that one? I've got 50 on it for all of it. Okay. All working. It's also got um, Grand Theft Auto inside. Yeah. Okay. And a chance to take out.
how much do you want the Lego? Um, which one is that? That's a Minecraft. Portal, yeah. Um, £20 for that one. 20 Brand new, hasn't been played with. Oh, uh, right yeah. Okay. okay. Found each. 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 Excuse me, how much got that one? A uh, pound. pound. Okay. No, actually 50 p. 50 p. Okay. Yeah, it's a little bit in here, though. Get some decent power supply sometimes. Samsung. Not too bad, maybe. How much have you got in your cables? Oh, I've got to try one of Sorry. Pound for that. Pound. Some are 50p, some are a pound. Okay. The bigger they are, the more they are. Yeah. Because I basically weigh them in from. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. those two would you have change for a five I've run out of yeah, yeah, yeah. coins okay you want to be five <laughs> I love five I do yeah they're quite nice little notes really do you know what I like them right you will learn this as you go through life right if I put a stack of 50 pound notes on the table, a stack of 20 pound notes on the table, and a stack of 10 pound notes on the table, and a stack of 5 pound notes, you know what I'm The wife only nicks the 10s, 20s, and 50s. She never takes the bag of fivers. No. So I'm better off with fivers. Yeah. <laughs> it works that way, you'll yeah. learn that one day, son. Don't leave it about. I had a taxi driver friend who started on a piss. 600 pound in his wallet. Come back, pissed out of his head, two kebabs, go to bed, wake up, wallet empty. All right. Because he was so pissed, he left his wallet on the table in the kit. And as soon as she got up, she'd go through it and take what was left. All right. Yeah. 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 Okay. How <laughs> cold? Thank you. Kids football shoes. Don't usually do well, that's good. Probably not. Would you would you three pound on it? Oh, 
Um, no, mate. No, just five. Yeah. I'll take it for five. Thank you, cheers. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Does that include the cables? Sorry? Does that include the cables? Yeah, everything. Yeah. Yeah, everything you see there is yours for £10. Okay, I'll get that £10. Have you got one controller though? Yeah. yeah, fine. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Buzz light here. They always have broken glass pieces on top there. They always seem to have that missing. That's a knock-off one. If you want, I'll do it a lot of 15 quid. You can't go any lower than that. I'm okay, thank, thank you. Yeah, appreciate it. Okay, I'm now back from the car boot and as you can see, I've got some okay stuff here. So some decent profit stuff in some of this stuff here. And some of it I have not actually checked up. So we'll have to put some pictures on screen for some of it. Uh, but first, we'll go over the uh, magazines quick. So these here, I paid £2 for both of them. So a pound each. I thought the seller said £2 each. But I was wrong. I actually gave me £3 change from a fiver. So yeah, pound each. And... um. Not the biggest profit in the world on these ones, but still okay. This one here, I saw similar ones uh, not sold, I don't think. I mean, it might have been sold, actually, on this one. Uh, between, like, three and eight pounds on that one. Um, but, yeah, usually they are American. You can see they've got dollars at the back down here, down there. So, six, $17 there. But secondhand, these have been selling for about three to eight pounds sold on those ones. This one here, I could not find this sold anywhere. Uh, but the brand new one of these was going for around about £14, I think it was. Or was it $14? £14, I think it was on that one. And the same with this one. This one here is from the United States as well. It's got $20 on the back of that one. So I might ask £7, £8 on that one there. So, yeah, not too bad of a pick-up on those. They're okay for a pound each on those. I sometimes like to pick up these, but it's just something else to put on your eBay store. And, um, yeah, they do sell. I have sold quite a few uh, comic books or magazines like this. So, yeah, not bad at all on those. They're okay. Next, we have got one of these free 4 gigabyte uh, routers. So it's like a Wi-Fi router from free. And these are pretty good, actually, on eBay. So this one here, I saw some solds. I think it was at £30 for second hand. And for opened, never used, it's about £42. 
Now this one here looks to be open but never used because it's still in its original bag. So I'll have to give it a check over first and see if it's in really good condition. If it's in a really good condition, I will ask £42 and that is the sold price. But if it's obviously been used, I'll probably end up putting it for £30 and that's the sold price again on that one. So yeah, £5 into £30, £42, not too bad at all on that one. Really easy to pack up as well and uh, into a little box. So yeah, pretty good on that one there. So we got that. Next, we got some cables. So I got some cables from a seller. Uh, they cost me £1.50 for the two. And this one here, I couldn't find on the internet. Uh, it's just because I can't find any branding on it. So what I'll do is, if I find that, I'll leave it on the screen. I'm pretty sure it's a laptop charger, but we have to see on that. So that one there, I'm not too sure of the value of that one. But this one here, I found this one. It's a Samsung. So if we can get that up there, it's a Samsung. And I can't find the model number, but if you can see the model number on there, you can see what model number that is. But that one there, um, this one here is worth about £12. So yeah, that's what the seller is asking, £12 on that one. Doesn't mean it'll sell for £12. Maybe I'll put it for £10, I'm not too sure yet. I'll see if I can find some solds on that. If I do find any solds, I'll leave it on the screen so you can see that. So not too bad for like a pound, a uh, pound fifty for the two. So pretty good on those ones. Also from the same seller, I got this dark saver from the Mandalorian from Star Wars. And these can do pretty well. So I paid 50p for this one. First he said a pound, but then he went straight to 50p. So I paid 50p for that one. And they go for around about 23 pounds sold listings on those. And it does work as well. So if I press that button, there we go. All the lights do come on. Now we'll turn that off. There's a pretty good item really there. 50p into 20 pounds, uh, maybe 23 yet. But um, yeah, not too bad on that one there as well. Decent profit in that one. Also, I'll be able to send that with Yodel for around about two pounds 88. So yeah. Pretty good in postage as well on that one there. Next, we've got some plushes here. So these ones here, original Disney, as you can see there. So we've got original Disney tags on the bottom of these. So I haven't looked these up yet. So I'll leave some prices on the screen, but I don't think they're going to be that much. I paid, what was it, £4 for both? So £2 each on these. This one here has got a bit of ruined up laces. That will affect the value on that one a little bit. But yeah, hopefully I get them a little bit cleaned up. There's a few little stains on his boots. Uh, you can probably see that just there. Uh, I have to get that cleaned up if I can. But £2 each, not too bad. Uh, they might be worth £7 each, maybe. Something like that. We have to see on that. That's just a guess. And next, we have got this Xbox 360e. So this is one of the newer Xboxes. And um, yeah, it comes with the controller. Also got the power supply as well. And this one here is a 500 gigabyte one, which is pretty good. Usually the 500 gigabytes hard drive that is inside of the Xbox, you can sell them for around about £20-25 on their own. So if this console doesn't work, I can just take the hard drive out, sell that. And also the power supply is worth about £16-ish. Uh, the last time I used to sell them at that price. So we'll have to see if it's still worth that. But still, if this doesn't work, they're pretty good to sell on their own. Also the hard drive as well. So I paid £10 for the Xbox with the power supply controller. And also some of the cables as well, which are in the bag at the moment. But if, if everything's working, that should be about £50, £60 maybe for that bundle. So what I'll do is I'll leave a picture on screen of a thumbs up or thumbs down if it's working. So we'll have to get that tested later. So we've got that there as well, which is a pretty good item. £10 into £50, £60 if it's working. Pretty good. If it's broken, I might get £10 for it just for the Xbox. The hard drive will sell separately. So you definitely look out for these consoles, especially if they've got a 500 gigabyte hard drive in them. If they've got a 250, not worth so much. Uh, even a 320 gigabytes still is okay, but not the best. The 500 is the best hard drive you can get in these consoles. So you definitely look out for these if you do see them at the car boots or even charity shops and stuff like that. But that is everything I've got today at the car boot. If you enjoyed this video, I'd really appreciate it if you leave a like. If you want to see more car boot videos, check out one of these here on screen. But that is everything I had in this video and I'll see you all in the next one.